African business is home and abroad One minute TV The best in the whole way to sell your brand to the world One minute TV Support in African business is home and abroad One minute TV Everything is free, you just need to feed the team up One minute TV Support in African business is home and abroad One minute TV The best in the whole way to sell One minute TV is still at US The football, they are in half time now and um, I'm here with one of the Arsenal fans in UK. He loves football. If you don't take time, he will sleep with football. Today is in Ghana. He's the owner of Jewels. And we want to know his view about Ghana football in whole and this tournament. It's about 40 years ago when we had the cup before. So, Mr. Richmond, I think 40 years ago, you may be a young man then. I don't know whether you know how we got the cup here, which people got the cup. But today, you are here, sitting down here, watching the football on uh, uh, DSTV. In Accra, Achimota, my seven, jewels and lunch and uh, lunch and hot bar. Yeah. Which you can eat, you can eat any food. There's, there's everything here. I mean, there's VIP. If you have your Kokoma, you can come here. If you have your family, um, you want to have a birthday party or something like this, you can come here. We will show you inside later on. But now, we are talking about football because it's because of football we are here. Say something about football. Um, Do you think we're going to bring the I, I think as a Ghanaian, uh, my first priority is to see Ghana win the tournament. And uh, it will be a bad thing on my part to say Ghana will not win. I believe we have the potential to win. We have the right players. And uh, we've made changes to our technical setup. And I'm sure our new team, Milo, uh, team manager, will bring the club back home. It's been many years since um, Ghana won it. Um, uh, in my lifetime, we haven't won it. Mm -hmm. um, we've been to the point where... We can at the same time watch the match. Yeah. We've been to a point where we missed it. I remember when... Uh, went on Fanas with uh, Fanas and Agus Pele. Yeah, was that was that was 1992. 1992. <laughs> and in fact, that was a sad day for me. It was a sad um, day. Every yeah, time we come <laughs> cheering our national team, uh, the Black Stars, and then uh, we get disappointed. But whichever way, we can't say because we've lost it, we will never have uh, faith in our team. We expect to win it and we will win it big. So you expect. Ghana to win it. Yes. And you think we will win it? Yes. Uh, I'm sure there are teams that uh, have been tipped to win it, for example, Senegal and others. But in football, it doesn't really matter. Some people will be given the names, all the big names. By the end of the day, um, it's about uh, technique, it's about strategy. If your strategy is good, you can outplay, you can win and um, uh, beat anything uh, when presented to you. Yeah. And I'm sure Ghana will win with. Um, my lovely have a depilation lady there in Ghana Black South. So you want to say that those those projected that teams that are going to win, Ghana is not among of them. Um, projections are like um, American elections where everybody said that Trump was going to lose. And at the end of the day, he won. <laughs> um, the, the, we've had tournaments where big, big teams were tipped to win, but they didn't. For example, in the last um, era, uh, cup uh, tournament, what happened was that they, everybody tipped France to win, but they, 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 they didn't go anywhere. Yeah, yeah, they were true. tipped to win. Mm -hmm. So don't, don't be bothered about what people say about Ghana and people not tipping Ghana to win the day. But I think um, we, we, we have the potential to beat any, any team at the end of the day. 40 years ago. 40 years ago, Nana Kufado said it just, I think, the day before yesterday. I mean, giving them moral support for them to bring the cup home. At that time, we have, um, um, I think Abedi was that time the youngest uh, player ever in it with Kosiapia and those those guys. I think it was in the 80s. That was 82 or 83. And they played in Libya. I think so, if I'm not mistaken. I think it was in Libya. That, that was the last time we got a cup. We've been going all over. 
Um, we even hosted here in Ghana, I think twice, in, as I, if I can remember, or more than that. Nothing. We had a Ghanaian coach. We had all kind of foreign coaches. Nothing. What is the difference between this or the coaches and this one? Yes, uh, even this coach I've been here before. I think, I, think, I, think I think I have the spirit of the Lions, the uh, British. Yeah. Uh, where every time they believe that uh, the cup is coming home. And um, it is that spirit that um, I will encourage and entreat all our fellow Ghanaians mm -hmm. to support our team and pray that uh, we can perform to the, our best mm -hmm. and bring the cup home. I don't think we should be relying on our disappointments and our failures. We should be looking at the opportunities out there. And I believe uh, there is so much potential out there for us to succeed. So I would say Ghana is going to win until the game is finished. Everyone can win. Okay, this is the opening match. So I think uh, we're not going to say much about it. But um, the way they are playing, I think you have watched the match. I think just one minute ago they started again. And, and what do you think? The performances you have, you saw the uh, first half. The performances, what are you going to say? What, what can you say about it? Because I believe, the I believe, I believe, I believe we, we could have done better. But the game is still on. And I'm sure the, the team manager will come up with a strategy to beat the team. And I still maintain that Ghana is going to win. We still let's maintain not, that Ghana is let's going not to be worried win. about what. Let's, let, let's not be worried about it. Um, the game hasn't ended. We will win. I like your moral support and I like your vim and with your yeah. lion heart. Okay, we are here in uh, Jewels. What is duels? What, 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 what is the motivation behind those duels? I need to take you around for, for you to see duels. I need to take you around for you to see duels. Oh, yes. yes, yes. Lounge and Bar. Uh, we present a food package <laughs> where you can come in, you have food to eat, um, you can watch your live football. Mm -hmm. If you are a fan of football, if you are not a fan of football, there are other games that you can watch. Uh, we have all the um, expensive uh, spirits, uh, Hennessy, or uh, any drink, at all. any drink that you want to drink. Uh, we have uh, very delicious food. We have one of the best chefs in the house. So any food that you like, uh, we can prepare to you in a very short space of time. Um, we want people to come here for our home where we have a very cozy VIP area where um, when you come in, you feel very comfortable. Yes, we have CCTVs around. We, are, we don't have the CCTV to monitor and watch people on what they do. But for example, if anybody comes here and messes about you, leave your phone and you cannot find it, with the help of the CCTV, we can track it and then get it to you. And once people are aware that uh, the CCTV here, the likelihood of them performing any criminal behavior reduces. So I believe um, we've made this place a home, a home for you to come and enjoy yourself. On Saturdays, uh, Sundays, we have a mutual special, which we do from 11 uh, a.m. Uh, until we leave. And we open from uh, Sundays and other days um, from 10, 11 a.m. to 3 a.m. every day. And we are here. Anytime you want us, we are here. So it's, it's basically Monday to Monday. Monday to Monday. Monday to yeah. Monday. We are here every day. Yeah. And normally, if I go to places like this, and before um, I will sit down and talk about food, I have to have my food in front of me. Because me, I love food. I should have had my food. But I think it's not too late. I will get it before. Because any food that I will advertise for people to come and eat, I have to taste it. What do you think? Um, I, I think it's a good uh, suggestion that you have made. See? I think um, you should have come up with a uh, written uh, concern for me to know what you wanted. You haven't said that. So, um, I, what, what, I, we do for our customers, what we do for our customers, we do things uh, at a very low, cheap price, mm -hmm. which we can give you as a subsidized fee. <laughs> 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 you see, guys, people watching Grand Night TV, Grand Night TV love food. And normally, if you see, if I go to restaurants and bars and uh, um, uh, eating places, even local ones, I have to eat before. Uh, I mean, I I, I I I introduce the food or talk about the food. You see, this man, he don't want to give me the food, but I will eat it before. Before I will move and go to the VIP and look inside, I will get my food and eat it here and now before. You, you, you see, because the youngest old boys always like to eat. 
Brother, thank you. Thank, thank you, you for your, uh, your view about the football. The game hasn't ended yet. We just started the match. Today is the first day. So we'll be coming here. Guys, come here at Jules and come and watch the football here. It's DSTV free. And if you come here, there's any drink. You can bring your girlfriend, bring your wife, bring your kids. Anytime Ghana is playing football, anytime anyone is playing football, you can watch the match from day one up to the end, the final, here in Duos. Keep watching Pamina TV. Come and eat. It's Vanuaha. We will go inside there. You will go and show us inside there. Cameraman, please. My cameraman, Kinzito. He will follow me. Let's follow, follow me to, to the... So men abroad, Kwame na TV Everything is free, you just need to be the team up Kwame na TV Most in African business, so men abroad Kwame na TV The best thing the only way to sell your brand to the world Kwame na TV Keep watching Kwame na TV, we are here in Duo And you know, as I said, this is VIP Here is VIP And I think the top is the VVIP Look at how the place is set up First, just look at what is happening here. When you have your girlfriend, you have your wife, you, ha you have a party, birthday party, any party at all, you can come here and celebrate it. The guy himself is here. He is going to explain it more than what I do. And any drink, drink beer, any drink at all, you get it here. That drink even is from Russia, from uh, Donald Trump's country. It's you get some here. Boss, yes. tell us something. Tell the viewers what you are doing here and um, why you even decided to uh, bring Justin up. As I spoke to you earlier on, um, Jewel's Lounge and Bar is a place that we set up where we, may, we want people to come here and feel at home. Where we, we offer very delicious meals. Uh, we have one of the best chefs in town. Uh, we have uh, the perfect sound system where we uh, the best DJ. Uh, we play music from the opening to the time that we finish. Um, it's a place where you can come and watch football if you're a fan of football. Um, I'm not, when I talk football, I'm not talking about the useless American talk. I'm talking about the football that we kick with our foot. And, um, <laughs> And I'm sure that what is this? Like American so yes, people don't. No, no, right. So, you can't what are you talking about? Can't see someone. Uh, American, American soccer. Americans also play football. And they are no, one of the world yeah. rank. You just play. unless you want to unless, unless you are referring to you uh, just want to say that because there's someone yeah. here who is from America. No, no, unless you want to uh, <laughs> refer to uh, basketball, no, the, the, as a home of football is UK. Do, do you like, do you really know where I came from? I came from America, and so uh, uh, I I love my American football. Uh, uh, fortunately, fortunately, I'm happy that I don't have a child here. Else, uh, I'll be hearing uh, swear words and others, which is very despicable, and we do not tolerate in the part of the world that I live. Um, yes, that was you. Uh, we've already yeah, shown you to our bar, and uh, we have our main uh, forum where you can sit. But we are at this moment, we are the VIP. The VIP um, is what we want to talk about now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um, it's very uh, serene, quiet, calm, where you can chill. Um, you can bring your boyfriend, you can bring your husband, you can bring uh, anything that you, anybody that you want. Uh, that is your own business. Uh, fortunately, we have cameras here as well. It's not to check you. We don't care about what you do here. But what we matters to us is your safety. That if should anybody uh, make your phone or you lo lose your phone, you leave it behind, we'll be able to track it and get it back to you. It's all to protect you and nothing else. Uh, we don't go in looking at what people have done. It's only when there's an incident that we may have to refer to it and then um, bring about and uh, detect whoever has caused a mess here. So uh, it's a lovely place. Um, we have a lot of people, dignitaries coming here, ministers. Um, appointees, uh, people from NP, NDC, different um, burgers as well. Burgers, we had ah, our burgers yeah. night um, two days ago, and uh, it was lovely. Um, fortunately, we had people from the UK, so it was decent. Um, there wasn't any gun, <laughs> yeah, it was very, very decent. <laughs> not, not the bad crowd. Well, now, what you are trying to say that you want to tell us that, um, um, 
people who are from UK are more decent than the other people from the other places. Every burger is a burger. Everyone is. Uh, if the moment you left out of this country and go up there, you, you are from outside. You see? You see? You are from outside. <laughs> so why are you uh, bringing this type no, of no, issues no, no. I, I no, only brought it in for, uh, for the purpose of clarity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't want anybody to misconstrue mis what I say. Okay. But what I know is that there are differences in where people live and others, and those people who believe in crime and others. But over here, we believe in the decency. We respect our customers who come here. We provide the best of service. Uh, we ensure people are satisfied. We want customers to come here, leave and come back, and leave as a feedback. And what we do is that we act on uh, customers' feedback. We don't just listen, but we act on them. Uh, we have um, waitresses and waitresses uh, who are here. What we do is that uh, we bring in competent people to train them time and time. And if there is anything that comes up that we don't know, we bring in other people to also uh, give us their views on it and how to improve our service. We are a new um, restaurant, is a, a restaurant a lunch. What we want to do is to provide the best of service to everyone. Mm -hmm. And uh, we intend to make mm -hmm. sure that our service is very consistent mm -hmm. and uh, in our delivery and our customer satisfaction should be 100% all the time. Mm -hmm. We are not going to uh, relinquish and um, wait until uh, we get 100%. If 99%, we are not going to accept it. We are 100%. So this is the top uh, upstairs. Yes. The and top. if you see the branded, um, uh, uh, Jewels, it's London. here VVIP. Yeah, this is the VVIP. And the down yeah. there is yeah, VIP. Yeah. I so, love, I love the way the yeah. setup is. Yeah. And I love the way you brand your listeners too. I, I, it's fantastic. Thank you. So Thank it's you. some place that I think, uh, we that don't have wives can just get our new dating and guests. Yeah. Um, we bring people here. People come and sit down. We have single ladies coming here. Uh, oh, there's single ladies oh, all along. Will I, will I, will I, I, If you are interested, and I think, um, should I come? Uh, you're always invited. <laughs> um, it's your brother's pub, so it's your pub. You know? That's true, that's yeah. true, that's true. Yeah, it's always lovely to see you. It's lovely yeah. to see you. Too. Keep watching Kamna TV, like, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to press the notification bell so any video that's come, you'll be the first person bump to see it. I mean, this is the place. This man here, think about places that we go because he, he liked chilling so he decided to open a chilling place he liked chilling he like he loved dancing i remember when i come down and meet him at at the gate we would dance and come in he <laughs> loved that so he getting a place like this for me it's no wonder because if you love something and you put your energy in you will get there so People become footballers, people build houses, people do other type of businesses, but he also decided to be, get this entertainment place because he loves entertainment. That is why he's here. He lives all the way UK and come here and invest here. At the same time, giving job to Ghanaians here. So that means he's helping the economy. He's helping the economy. Guys, such this is what we want that we want people to come back home and invest people to come back home and invest like 2021 december when we had the taste of ghana it was amazing and today on the 10th of january there's a football going on afco which is ghana uh, um, african cup of nations and dstv here in uh, uh duels uh, you can sit down and watch. What are you, if you want to come and sit down at the top here, come. Today is the first match of Ghana. So, Ghana and Morocco. So, if you want to watch a football from today going, any match at all, it is free. Come, just buy a drink, get your food, and eat till the match finish. And everything goes on here smoothly. Cool, chill. I mean, it's amazing. The food is what I'm talking about. I'm going to have my own down there and I will show it to you how I will eat that food. And don't forget we are on Facebook and we are on um, uh, Instagram. Yeah, as well. we're, so, we're, we're, uh, Facebook, Instagram. Us and like us. Thank you. Okay, guys, keep watching Cardinal TV.
my brother Richmond Benson, you didn't even say anything about your name. Say your name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I am Richmond Benson, uh, the double chairman. Um, people know me by double chairman. So the double chairman. MPP <laughs> chapter Martin King's chairman, then MK Men. Association, Association chairman. chairman. So he's the double chairman. He has been on double chairman, I think, almost three years or four yeah. years now. 2018 yeah. or up 20, to uh, yeah, 2018 up to the start. No challenger. They say any challenger, no challenger. People, people just, they, when they say they should vote, they say, no, we don't want to vote. He has to be there. That's it. Guys, you. Keep you, watching. We'll see you soon. Thank you. We'll see you. Most of these businesses we don't see The best pictures are heading I just said to share uh -huh. yeah. Most of these talents are heading Most of these businesses we don't see